This is example 3.8 on page 76 in your textbook. And as you can see in the diagram, we have a pipe with a fluid A that's flowing in it, uh, flowing from left to right. The pipe is inclined, so it's actually flowing uphill. There's a manometer that's connected between two different points. That's uh, point one and point two. Um, fluid B in the manometer is actually mercury, fluid A being water. Um, we're giving, given the difference in height from the one side to the other side of the mercury, 25 millimeters, the water is flowing at 10, 10 degrees C. Um, and we're asked to calculate what is the difference in head between one and two. Um, oh, sorry, the, the difference, yes, the difference in head between one and two and the difference in pressure between one and two in kilopascals, point one and point two. So it's the head difference and the pressure difference. So the difference in piezometric head, uh, that's just a term indicating um, all the heads together, so it's including pressure and height. So that's H1 minus H2, I think it's delta H, which is your change in height in the manometer. And here we've got gamma Hg over gamma water minus 1. And that's the piezometric head equation, a difference in head at a point. We know delta H is 0 0.0125 and gamma Hg is 133,000 and gamma water is 9810 minus 1. So therefore H1 minus H2 gives us 0.31 meters, 310 millimeters. The second part of the problem is the difference in pressure. So P2 is equal to H gamma water pressure at 0.2 and we know what the, what H is 0, 0.31 times 9810 P2 is equal to 3,4 four. Pascals. All right, and there's the, the head. So that's the end of the problem.